John Bird of the Hart County Lady Raiders. First of all, we want to say congratulations to you, Coach Bird. For those of you that's watching, Hart County Lady Raiders had not won a district game all year. They come in tonight as a four seed and upset Greene County the first time in I don't know how many years, but you're going to the regional tournament. Coach, give us a little rerun of the game tonight. Well, it, it was all hard. I mean, these uh, ladies, I tell you, uh, you know, we youth, uh, you can't say enough about their fight. You know, most usually, you know, you get a young group coming in, and they're scared to death, but they, they, they hit us pretty hard throughout the season, and we knew we didn't have much to lose because they beat us 20-plus in both games. Uh, we had a really good uh, uh, game report for them, the scouting report, and uh, we followed it to a T. I couldn't be any prouder than a bunch of girls that I am tonight. You know, I was just talking to Dia Bradley's uh, father about, about her play tonight. You know, early on in the game, I, I told her, told, told Paul that I kind of saw her seventh grade in her a little bit. And, you know, you, you can expect that from a seventh grader, but most seventh graders across the state can't come in and score five points at a crucial moment like she did there in the last minute and 14 seconds of the, of the, of the game. Her and Sturgeon played a, a absolutely phenomenal game, but what people fail to realize is this Hart County team is, is made up of just about all seventh and eighth graders. Am I right? That, that is correct. We got, we got sophomores, a couple sophomores, and junior. Uh, the majority of our plan is from 7th, 8th to freshmen. Uh, but the thing about it is, it was a total team effort. And I'm so proud of that number. 11, 12 girl on the bench, uh, our, our water girl, I tell you, it just took everybody. And we, and we knew that going in, and they had to believe. And one thing about it, I scared them to death. Uh, I brought them in a scouting report, and I had about six pages. Told them they going to have a test open. And uh, that scared them to death. But I told them, I said, this is all the stuff we're going to do. We've been doing. I just want you to see it and see how much emphasis we're putting on this and knowing that we're going to go in and win this game. Coach, and that's what you did. You came in. Probably the biggest upset in the region on the girls' side so far. I know district just started last night. But you guys are advancing to the region. You'll play the winner of Coverta LaRue County on Friday night to see where you stand as far as 